You ever feel like Minecraft just isn't what it used to be? Like when you were a kid, everything was so awe-inspiring. But now everything's kind of the same and dull. Well, check this out. Wow, dude. I'm honestly speechless. <laughs> so, let's play a little Minecraft today. Oh, wait. That's like a, a shipwreck, right? I think it is. God, it's really far away though, isn't it? It's going to take me a while to get there. Yeah, I think this is one of the uh, the custom shipwrecks. It's not like a boat shipwreck, but there's like floating debris in the water and there's a bunch of chests and barrels and they've always got pretty good loot in them. Oh, two saddles. Okay. That's pretty good. Coast trim, sure. All right, that'll work. My inventory is going to get pretty full though, pretty quickly. Oh, wait, you see that? That's one of the, um, I talked about that in a, in a video. It's one of those custom fleets. Yeah, that's right. I, I knew these things spawned. These, these always have like a ton of loot, a ton of villagers in them. I think that's another one over there too. Yeah. Cool, man. Wow. There's a lot of stuff in this ocean. Yeah, and they got a downstairs too. Look at this. It's so cool. I don't know space for all this stuff. I'm guessing this giant ship, the centerpiece one, has the best loot. Oh, is this their valuables? Don't mind if I do. This honestly might be a little bit OP, this kind of thing, but... Dude, this loot is crazy. I think, honestly, I don't really need to loot the other, uh, ships. I'm pretty much set. Bro, what do you want? Oh, I can try out the better combat. That's so cool, dude. I love the animation. Oh, <laughs> Man down. He's Where is he going? He's just, like, abandoning ship. <laughs> Where is he going? This guy, too. They've, they've had enough. Oh, legendary shield. Let's go, dude. Look at that. Like, I get, I get a speed boost by holding it. That's crazy. That's one of my favorite mods, dude. Tiered Z. It adds these, like, Terraria modifiers. It's so cool. I'm getting far from spawn now, dude. I'm, like, 5,000 blocks out. Yeah, dude. These little tiny boats look like nothing. Compared to those fleets back there. They just have like seaweed in them. They're like fisherman boats. At some point, I'm going to actually have to start working on a base. Some sort of build. Because I've got all these items and now I'm going to do something with it. <laughs> I love swimming with dolphins. Alright, finally getting towards land now. Looks pretty scenic, dude. Look at this. As I'm thinking about it, given that I am like 5,000 blocks from spawn, there's not really anything established at my base. I wouldn't be opposed to to finding a new spot and i know people are like dude this is the second time now that you've abandoned your spawn because the first video i also abandoned my original base but i don't know dude this is pretty beautiful look at this like the spot that i'm at it's just like some dumpy watchtower there's not actually anything around it so there might be potential to settling out here oh you see that what is this it's like a little red hut whoa it's like a little camping tent dude look at that sword oh my god that's a lot better than mine. I'm definitely taking that. A legendary bow, dude? Oh my god. I am living it up out here. Th yeah, this must be some sort of weapon master tent. That is cool, man. Whoa. What is that block? I'm so confused. Are these like bone blocks? They're dropping bones. Permafrost. That has to be from a mod, dude. There's no way that's vanilla. Oh my god, dude. That is an insane view. Dude, this view is ridiculous. <laughs> like, oh my god. This is probably the most impressive view I've seen yet using Distant Horizons. That is mental. Legitimately, that's mental. It's like I'm in the Himalayas. Here, I gotta take a screenshot real quick. What a view. All right, so what can I see? Is there anything I could see up here? I'm not seeing any structures quite yet. Oh, that's definitely a village. All right, that's right, that's got potential. Um, I don't honestly see a whole lot over there. <laughs> it's just like a barren, snowy wasteland, but you know, it has potential, I suppose. That plateau though, that's really cool. Maybe I'll head in that direction. I was just thinking like, oh, it'd be so easy if I just took the boat down, right? But if you saw the video I did with my friend, Jack, I tried to go off the mountain in a boat and I literally died. And I think it was because of a random fall damage bug that's been in the game forever. So I am gonna be, I'm gonna take the slow and steady route this time, <laughs> especially cause there's like spikes 
Look at that. What if I just like fell in one of those? That would not be good. All right, let me. I'm gonna try to get to that village before sundown. Oh, is this more of that permafrost stuff? That's so cool that it adds that to the taiga biomes. Or like all the snowy, cold biomes. Whoa. What is this? This feels like a trap of some sort. Let me keep my distance. It's like a little shrine in the woods. That's pretty cool. Alright, we gotta be getting close to the village now, I would think. Yeah, there it is. Here, I'll go inside this church for now. Alright. Good to be out of that rain. I saw this massive plateau on the, the mountain up there, so I want to get on top of this. Yeah, maybe we can go exploring some caves, too. I see that there's there's two different villages right near me. That's pretty nice. There's a lava pool right here, so I could go to the nether if I wanted to. Because honestly, I've got all the loot that I need. I've got full iron. I've got food and torches, so that could be the next thing I do. Yeah, dude, look at this plateau. I mean, this thing is formidable. I mean, that's like a proper mountain. It's like as big as those mountains over there. So, wow, dude. Dude, this is so cool. It's like a little, like, skate ramp. <laughs> you see that? How it, like, dips down? That is amazing. So we got a village up here. There's another church right there. I mean, honestly, dude, I could take my stuff from that church down there and move up here. This is a beautiful spot. Wow, dude. I'm honestly speechless. <laughs> I think this is the spot. Up in this vista, like I've built a house right on this cliff, and this was my view. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, so I think for now, I'm gonna take my stuff from that church down there, bring it up here, and we'll make some sort of makeshift home. God, I have to go all the way back down just to come back up. Alright, just in back for sundown. Here, I'll leave some of the really not important stuff in here. Okay, now to run back <laughs> to where I was. This is good though, I'm glad I finally found a location that I actually really enjoy. Like, I wasn't that into the first island spawn, and I wasn't that into the watchtower I found, but this is like... This is it. This is the spot. Actually, while I'm down here, let me grab a horse. That'd be good. There we go. Oh my god, he's like the slowest he possibly could be. Oh well, it's still faster than running. I can do better than that, dude. That is so slow. How about this guy? He might be a little bit faster. He looks cooler. That's the main point. He looks like he matches my armor. That's pretty good. Oh yeah, it's a lot faster to go up the mountain though with a horse. That is undeniable. This really is a massive plateau, man. I mean, this terrain is so striking. And there's a village right there. I mean, that is... This is the perfect spot. So I'll stay in this... A uh, little church for now. Ooh, that'll be useful for the nether. Fire resistance? Alright, so should I try to go to the nether now? I mean, that's a little ambitious. I'm pretty sure, yeah, there's a lava pool right there. Go use this. Well, knowing me, I don't want to just make like a basic portal right here. I kind of want to make a little aesthetic one in a cave. Here, could this work? Yeah, we could put the nether portal in here. Just dig out a little spot for it. I think I actually have six obsidian, don't I? Uh, yeah, six obsidian. Shall we? Alright. This is actually probably a pretty good spawn. The portal's all protected. Alright, so can I spot anything off the bat? Oh, wait, is that a structure? There's something, like, rectangular looking down there. Oh, is that a fortress? <laughs> oh, let's go. Yeah, because that's those are blazes. Alright, I just gotta get down there. That's the tricky part. Dude, this is gonna be so sketchy though. So like the way this works with ladders, if you shift click, you can do like a drop ladder, but like it's just a little bit scary. Oh man, that's sketchy. That is so sketchy. Oh my god. This is so scary. Oh. I hope those blazes aren't close enough to me that they could just shoot me off. Right, we're good. I survived. Right, okay, so that's the fortress. And I have to it's like a deadly lava lake to get to it. Oh, jeez. Alright, it's just a, like a lot of wither skeletons, though. 
The only building blocks I have are flammable. Oh my god, bro. This, this is stressful. Alright. Made it a little bit farther. Oh, it's one of those blaze guardians. Those things... That's what killed me in the video with my friend Jack. A bunch of wither skeletons right there. Oh. Oh. I didn't know blazes could melee you. That's news to me. Okay. Things just got even harder. I hope I'm not making any big mistakes by coming here this soon. Uh... <laughs> I wouldn't describe... Oh! Would not describe that as safer. <laughs> Definitely not. <laughs> Bullseye. Uh, armor trim. Alright. Hmm. Nothing that useful. Oh, I got a skull, dude. Oh, he picked it up? That's pretty lucky. It's only like the fourth uh, wither skeleton I've killed. Three gold ingots, dude. Who cares? I really wish they would update the loot tables of the fortress because it's just so underwhelming. Oh, <laughs> speaking of this, never mind. Two diamonds? Wow, I spoke too soon. I was just crapping all over it, and I got three diamonds. I stand corrected. Oh no. No, 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 no. No thank you. I think that's probably the extent of the fortress. I've probably gotten most of the loot that I'm gonna get. So I could head in that direction. I see sort of like a forest over that way. That's probably the next best place to explore. Maybe I should put some of this stuff on so they don't attack me. This looks promising. What is this? Oh, I think this is a bastion. Oh, God. Oh, wait, I can trade with these guys, right? Yeah. yeah. Who wants gold? Who wants gold? Maybe I can get obsidian from them, make a new portal. What was that? I hope they don't get angry when I steal their gold. This is a lot of gold, dude. It's like 16 blocks. Yeah, 16 blocks of gold. How much gold is that? Oh, my God. Oh, there's a chest down there. And of course, it's right where this little root is. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, what? They attack you if you attack the brute? Oh, God. Oh, my God. That was kind of bad because I was right by that edge. I didn't know that. I thought that if you attack the brutes, they don't attack you. Oh, God. Okay. I have a lot more to deal with then. Yeah, this guy is angry with me. Oh, okay. That is most of it, I think. Alright, I think the coast is clear. Oh, it's not even that good. Like, what do you use Crying Obsidian for? Alright, I don't see any more chests, so I think I'll just keep going. Infernal Dunes. Ooh. What do you want, bro? Oh! Golly, dude. <laughs> that was kind of bad. That was a little bit too close for comfort. I want to find some structures, man. There's got to be some castles or dungeons of some sort. Jeez, bro. I am being really careless. I need to be more careful. Alright, oh! Okay, that's definitely a structure, right? It's gotta be. Something circular down there. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a book. Uh, <laughs> do I dare take it? Uh, to summon the Inferno. Oh, God. I don't want to summon the Inferno, dude. <laughs> Maybe I'll just hold on to that for later. <laughs> this is cool, though. Yeah, it's like some sort of shrine. At this point, I don't think I'm really going to go back to the first portal I made. I'm just going to try to get enough obsidian from piglins and then make a new one. Oh, what is that? That looks like something up there. Oh yeah, this is definitely a different biome. Wow. This looks crazy, dude. You want to dance? Oh, this place is dangerous. God, there's two ghasts. This is ridiculous. Yeah, come on, pal. Dude, this is ridiculous. There's three of them now. That was crazy. Oh, they're shooting each other. Let's go. All right, back in the lava. Oh, bro, another fortress. Honestly, that's probably my best chance of finding obsidian. Two diamonds. All right. All right. No obsidian yet, but if I find piglins, I've got a good chance. Dude, there's- oh! Oh! Oh my god. That was really close. That was like three skeletons and a blaze. 
Okay, here we go. This is where the pick ones are. Good, good. This is what I've been waiting for. Oh, these attack you? Yeah, run away, little bitch. Where is he going? Why is he up here? Oh, arrows. Go away. Oh, is that obsidian? Oh, crying obsidian. What a tease. They do drop obsidian. I, I'm pretty sure they do. Why would I want nether brick? Why? Soul speed. Uh, I don't want to trade off my gold boots, though. Uh, we're going to be here for a while. Might as well get comfy. We'll make this all cozy for him. God, <laughs> this is the ugliest structure I've ever made. This is terrible. Uh, it'll keep me safe, though, while I trade with him. Gilded blackstone shard? What? Can you place that? Oh, what? It made a silverfish. This nether is just full of surprises. Obsidian, let's go. <laughs> Only one piece. Okay, that I'm. I was getting a little bit worried that they don't actually drop obsidian, so I'm glad that that was confirmed. I like how his nose twitches as he's inspecting the gold. Like, yeah, good stuff. Oh, we got another piece. Let's go. Seven. What is going on out here, dude? It's like this whole. <laughs> It's like a gang has showed up. They're trying to break his friend out. Oh, two more? Is that enough? Oh, it is. Okay, I can actually go home now. No, I placed one. Oh, wait, actually, I can make a diamond pickaxe. God, what a fail, dude. How did I do that? See ya. All right, one thing I just realized, though, is that I never wrote down the coordinates of my base. So I don't actually know where I am. God, I'm like 9,000 blocks from spawn. I guess what I could do is I could head in the general direction of spawn and then just try to like find my way back. <laughs> All right, this is about to be a very long hike home, so might be a while. Look at that tower, dude. That looks awesome. Definitely gonna go check that out. Oh, it's a pillager tower. Okay, so I was heading, I think, in this direction. Oh, <laughs> there's a villager up there. It's not the best loot. Hey, buddy, how you doing? All right, let's press on. Dude, look at this village view. That is amazing. Wow. <laughs> that is quite a view. All right, I'm just going to keep keep pressing on, I guess. I'm still not even remotely close to spawn. Whoa. Look at this. I don't want to go down there. Is that a pirate ship? Oh, it's a it's a pillager pirate ship. Oh, okay. I've seen these before a long time ago. Oh, here we go. Oh, they have a cat. Oh, dear. Oh! Yeah, jump down, I dare you. I don't know what- they're like jumping down from the masts. Are there like spawners up there? Alright, that wasn't quite as impressive as I thought, I'll be honest, but it was still a cool structure for sure. Wait, that's my cobblestone. What? <laughs> Wait, I've been here. I'm trying to remember my steps. Where- what direction was I going? Wait, my watchtower isn't behind this mountain, is it? Surely not. Wait, hold on. Let me let me build a little nerd pole up here. Oh, there's my watchtower. That's the inland ocean. Oh, okay. I know where I am now. I didn't think that I was going to come out right here. What was I doing over here? I don't remember building this cobblestone, though. Weird. Almost got a little bit spooked. Like, is there someone else in this world that I don't know about? I don't remember going over there. Maybe I did. I, I must have. Yeah, there it is. Okay, cool. Yeah, I definitely know where I am now. Alright, here we are. Um, yeah, okay, I left a lot of stuff here. <laughs> I left a lot of gold. Yeah, efficiency 4, like, I definitely should take that with me. So, I could go back that way through the inland ocean, the original way that I went, but I think I'm actually gonna sail around the coast. I know the general direction is that way, towards the new spot. That's right, that's Turtle Island over there. And I think that's my original spawn island over there. What was that sound? Some scary noises coming from the ocean. Oh! Bro, stop it. Oh my god. I literally flinched again. God, I hate that game mechanic. I saw some good comment on a video the other day about trying to make Minecraft more scary with mods. And they were talking about jump scares and how a jump scare in a horror game is like a comedian tickling you to laugh. And I really liked the, the, you know, felt like that was a really pertinent comic. Because it just, jump scares are just so cheap, you know? It's just relying on shock value. It's not actually good horror. I'm pretty sure that's my plateau. Or one of them. Looks like there's two different ones right there. Oh, what is that? Is that a windmill? Like, on a cliff? Man, that's a precarious building spot. 
I've got quite a climb ahead of me. Okay. There's the village. There's the church. Okay. Finally home, dude. That was like an hour of walking. Like, in real life, an hour. That was so long. Would have been so much faster if I just wrote down the coordinates. But that's pretty much all I wanted to do today. That was just a ton of exploration, a ton of adventure. I had a great time. Almost died a few times. So yeah, dude, that's about it. I'll see you later.